Namaste everyone and welcome back to Yoga and Me. Welcome to another session of our No Down Dog Yoga. Let's get started. No props required. And today we're going to start in tabletop position. So let's get down to our hands and knees. Hands shoulder width apart. Feet hip width apart. Knees underneath your hips and spread the fingers wide. Keep your elbows super straight. And just take some swirls here. Move your body. Clockwise. And then anti-clockwise, getting some movement into your hips, into your spine, into your arms. Inhale, we shift the weight forward. Exhale, we come back. Breathe in. In case you need some extra padding underneath your knees, either place a rolled blanket there or just double up your mat. This time, turn the palms up one at a time. And just shift your weight back and forth. And then switch sides. Keep your elbow as straight as possible. And release. Breathe in. Drop the belly. Lift the gaze. Breathe out. Cat cow. Five rounds. Inhale. Exhale. Breathing in and out. Two more. Inhale. Exhale. Last one. And exhale. Hold it here. Slowly lift. Look forward. Inhale, we kick the right heel up. Exhale, we draw the knee in. Breathe in. Breathe out. Last one. Inhale. Exhale. This time, step the right foot forward in between your hands. Lift your upper body. Find your low lunge, Anjaniyasana. Lower belly in. Try not to flare your ribs. Relax the shoulders. Reach your arms up. Make sure your feet are hip width apart here. One more breath. And release. Left hand down. Kick your right leg all the way back and find your modified side plank, Vashishthasana. Right hand goes behind your head. And now we're going to crunch with your right elbow and left knee. So press your right foot down. Breathe in. Breathe out. Inhale. Exhale. Breathe in. And breathe out. Drop the right hand down. And now step your right foot to the outside of your right hand for your lizard or grekel posture. Choose to stay here or go down to your forearms, but keep your shoulders open and your upper body active. Try not to hang loose or just dump into your back. Breathe in. Breathe out. Inhale. And exhale. One more breath. Lift back up onto your hands. Tuck your back toes under and pick up your back knee up. Look forward. Engage your belly. We're going to step the left leg all the way forward without stepping it down. So breathe in and breathe out. Keeping the right knee still bent and taking a bind here. Right shoulder to the inside of your right knee. Right hand behind. Then the left and we interlace the hands. If this is not possible, either just hold on to the clothing or maybe just left hand towards your lower back and we stay there. Breathing in. Breathing out. Keep your left toes flexed. Inhale. 
and exhale one more breath and release right foot to the inside of your left thigh and we go into a forward fold breathe in breathe out belly and thigh together spine long and straight and we look forward and release slowly lift find your tabletop position hands and knees once again we're gonna repeat the sequence on the left side so breathe in kick your left heel up this time breathe out left knee in inhale exhale breathe in breathe out step the left foot in between your hands and we lift up Anjaneyasana Melt your hips down and forward, front knee and ankle in one line. One more breath and release. Right hand down, step the left foot all the way back, finding the modified side plank, Vashishthasana. Left hand behind your head, breathe in, breathe out, inhale, exhale, breathe in, breathe out, release, left hand down, step the left foot to the outside of your left hand, lizard or grekel posture, maybe you go down to your forearms, lower the hips, better the stretch. Breathing in, breathing out, one more breath, lift back up onto your hands, pick up your back knee up, breathe in and breathe out step the left leg forward sorry the right leg forward and take your bind left shoulder to the inside of your left knee interlace the hands choose to stay high or maybe you like to fold forward breathing in breathing out Next inhale, slowly start to lift. Place your left foot to the inside of your right thigh. Breathe in, breathe out. Slowly lift on the next inhale. Find your child's posture, Balasana, before we finish this video here. Have a few breaths. Relax yourself after the hard work you have done. Stay here for as long as you want to. I'm going to finish this video here. Slowly start to lift and face forward. Finding a comfortable seat position facing towards the front. Thank you so much for doing this practice with me. I hope you enjoy it. We'll see you in the next part of this series very soon. Till then stick to the channel. Take care and bye-bye. Namaste.